Hey guys, uh, this is the Hamilton Beach 45 cup uh, coffee urn. Um, we had a problem with it before. Uh, people may have a problem, we just throw it out. Me, I like to investigate and see what's going on before I determine I can't fix it. So what I saw was, I can't show you now because I fixed it already, unfortunately, but this cord, this cord right here, right, the, for the plug, which is the, the plug, um, was twisted and twisted. Somebody twisted this plug where it ripped. See, there's two sides. There's one, I'll show you right here. There's uh, one side and two side. So one of the sides was twisted and ripped open, okay? We can see the wire. So when I plugged it in, it started sparking because it was making contact at times with the wire. I unplugged it, okay? And what I did was I unscrewed this black base. Okay, this black base only has two screws. I can't show you now because it's not, I can't turn it over right now. Um, but you use this kind of screwdriver, okay, and it's like a star screwdriver, not a Phillips, a scar, and it has three points, okay, three points. As you can see, it's three points, okay, special kind of tip which I have. Um, so you unscrew those two, take it out, and uh, I pulled the cord in about maybe an inch. And I spliced the wires together, taped it up with electrical tape, secured it, and uh, hoped it worked. So I plugged it in. I put about 10 cups of water in here, the 15 cups. And the light, in fact, did come on. I heard it percolating. And it is now hot. So now we now have my coffee urn back in business. Uh, just for, uh, t for FYIs, do not touch this part. It does say hot surface, okay? And in Spanish as well. Um... It is very hot because it's aluminum, uh, very thin aluminum. Uh, don't touch the top either. The top is kind of warm, but the bottom is hot, okay? Um, and uh, that's basically it. You know, people have said bad reviews about this, but I've had this for a year, and it's worked perfectly fine for me. Never had a problem except for that one, which I had fixed. Uh, <clears throat> and that's about it. Um, the insides are very simple, actually. Not really a hard... Um, and I, I would also say that uh, people ask questions, uh, can you boil hot water in here? The question is no, you don't boil hot water in here. Uh, it doesn't actually boil, it percolates. So it's like hot water and uh, that's steaming. That's what it is kind of doing. But it, it does kill the germs. It does kill back bacteria as well. Um, it's kind of like a boil, but it's not a boil. But yes, you can put hot water in here. Uh, well, you can put cold water in here, plug it in, it'll make the... Uh, water uh, hot and you can use it for hot chocolate hot tea uh, oatmeal whatever you want but I would say do not use a hot water uh, in the same machine you put the coffee in because your water will taste like coffee use one for coffee and use one for hot water if you can go that route okay always use one for coffee and always use one for hot water because once you put coffee in there it's gonna taste like coffee forever and it's a nasty taste so you know, for four, I think it's like forty-five dollars or something like that. It's worth it. Just get by two of them, and you'll have parties, and it's great to have. So I finished everything. I was I was waiting for the red light to come on to to confirm that it actually is working correctly. And there's a red light. It's on, and that's it. Um, I can't. Let me see. Yeah, I can't really pour it forward because, like I said, I lost a lot of cord because I had to splice it. But that's all right. I have uh, extensions at my job. All right, guys, so this is the Hamilton Beach 45 cup urn. Great to have. I give it a five star review. Uh, I've had no problems with it at all. I've seen bad reviews, but I haven't gotten one. Uh, this is a great machine, you know, and until it does break and I can't fix it, then I'll give a, a, an updated review of what happened and why it happened and how I feel about what happened. All right, uh, and that's it. All right, all right, thanks guys for watching. Uh, hope you get one and enjoy it like I do. Take care.